Oh boy, you just powered up your 3500. So if you don't have power continuously to this, even with the AF off, power off, AF all the way off, which would be your power off, and you power back up again, you're going to get some goofy stuff like this. Either you're going to get two zeros over here, and I have a digit there, and the first thing you think, another rare radio in the trash. Well, that's not the case. It's actually a pretty simple fix. So what you do is you turn off this all the way power. If it's already off, you're like, oh my God, what did I do? Well, you just go ahead and hit that reset button right there, which is the very last option on the squelch. It's a click, it's a reset. You click that back. Magic, you're back at 2600. It's always back at 2600. You stored up five memory channels here in the five memory banks. You can do it. You are on a last frequency you want to power up on. Well, this is one of those things. And of course, it's going to be an addition. This is one of those rare radios. Of course, it's one of the first 10 meter exports. 3300, 3500. It doesn't have battery backup on it. So if you turn the power off on this, say if I go 2700, well, you know, we'll just go right there. One, turn that off, turn it back on. You will have that. But if you do this with your power cord, and everybody does, and especially if it was ever used in a mobile. Thank goodness this was never used in a mobile. But if you tr take out the power cord, which I did right there in the back there, let it sit a second, and we will plug it back in. We either see some goofy numbers on the front of this. No, we don't this time. But when we power it up, 2,600 every time. Wipes out all the digits. So a lot of guys always kept these on power supplies. Just turned off the radio and left them on power supply. So they had all their five memories put in. But then came along a time when they did some battery backups. And you can add one to this, and it's basically a whole stack. It's double A's, actually three double A's, sorry, apologize. Three double A's stacked the all in series. That was it. Well, I wanted to do something a little better than that. I want to charge it off of what the power source is, put a battery inside, be done with it. I just want battery backup. So there it is. It's like a shotgun shell but everything's all inclusive in uh, heat shrink. Good, easy, but, but uh, yeah, when you power this up, we're 2600, which is great. So let's just do this, 26, let's just put a funky, crazy, 27231014, or 273314, whatever. Uh, we're just using this as a test, so we're gonna turn this off, and we're going to power, pull our power plug like we did before. Now this, we're disconnected completely. So we're going to have to go ahead and connect this back up. That's just a sample. Let's not uh, dilly-dally, guys. Let's do this. Power it back up. Turn it on. There we go. Yes, I know, it seems crazy, it seems unbelievable, yeah, newer radios, but yeah, back in the day, man, you didn't even have a battery backup, and this was something you couldn't get, especially this technology here and the lithium ion, rechargeable on it, it's 3.7 going, stepping up, 5 volts, that's what it needs. How long does this last? I don't know. So we should uh, test that next, I guess. But yeah, very cool. So I'm gonna go ahead and just mount this inside, unplug this thing, and just see how long this works. Uh, what's this, uh, 130, 623. Maybe we'll do another video after it dies, or 
maybe a couple days. We'll wait till maybe Saturday. Let's do that. We'll wait till Saturday to see if the same frequency comes up on this. What we're looking for when we power this up is this goofy little frequency we programmed it in three days ago. Now I know everyone's like, man, oh man, this is in every radio now. Well, it wasn't in this one, and this is one of the first, if not the absolute first export radio, which I am still saying. If you got another one, let me know. But it was also with the hidden features. We'll get into the CPU programming and some fun stuff you can do on HF and some other stuff. This thing has a surprise in it with a beautiful Easter egg. But we're going to get that down the road. Let's go ahead and just make sure we can get this goofy frequency up. Girl 30... Uh, six years old. So let's see what we got. Yep, we don't have that goofy uh, display coming up even when the power's off like we did before. Boy, it does freak you out every time that happens. But uh, we're looking for this frequency on this radio. And if so, then this battery backup worked exactly as I set it up and the way it should be. So yes, 273314, And now the cool thing about this is it's rechargeable. It's a lithium battery, so it'll go ahead and recharge while this is powered up. I can't wait to get into the uh, CPU um, tricks that you can do with this. It's kind of cool, kind of fun. Good Easter egg before Easter eggs. All right, 73. Appreciate y'all. See you in the next one.